It's May 27th. How are you doing? Please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and let's get into this. I was looking at 23A3 for the future, but the one that I've been following, 12P, and our compadres, and still in Lippis, the rabbit. We have these planets over here in Taurus. Mercury in the picture also. And Uranus is in there too. Now June 2nd is when it gets closest to the Earth. I've said that over and over. Let's take a quick look at Comet 12P because it has an anti-tail. And I reported it before. Return to an anti-tail to the Sun. Now taking a look at Comet Watch on Facebook. See the latest one right here. Beautiful image. Now this is A3 right here, seven hours ago. Yeah, let's take a closer look at it, zoom in. So that's where A3 is at by Virgo. So I'll keep an eye on that. I'm just doing preliminary 101 homework on it, but I'll get to that comment later. This image was taken by Jared two days ago. And right here, clearly you can see an anti-tail. Let's take a closer look right there. You have an anti-tail. That means it's connected. A lot of explanations about it. Dust, release of dust, energy, and all that. It's connected to the sun. It's energy connected to the sun. This is very rare. I think it's only happened eight times. The most recent one was Comet E3, which I covered. I think it was about last year. I have that information on the anti-tail, but I'll get more information about it. This one was posted 20 hours ago, taken on the 25th. Clearly, you can see the anti-tail right there. In this image here, a day ago, clearly you can see the anti-tail. Take a closer look right there. And look at how the tail changes. This sharp jet right here. So it's connected with the sun. Perfect beam like superb what an anti-tail this is rare excellent we got a nice anti-tail excellent so we have an anti-tail okay back in may 17 2013 i covered this comet 2011 l4 pan star here is a diagram this was the comet on the same date same time and this was an anti-tail see this is the ion tail and it had an anti-tail the distance almost 147 million miles away where it developed the anti-tail. And this was the result. On May 17th, same time, we had a beam directly with connected with the anti-tail explosion on the sun. This was covered. I just happened to be in the right place at the right time to capture all this. So this is one of the rare events having an anti-tail. I think there's been eight, eight of them. Now the comet will be somewhere in this vicinity, right here. The comet basically let's say just pretend it took the route this like the same route so it'd be right here right underneath the sun where you have the solar magnetic field lines yeah i made a video on it right here this is the title here's more images i caught of it i document it now looking at the sun live we got some weird patterns on on the like snake like filaments dancing all over the sun this is live okay we got a beam right here right there where the comet basically would be, comet will be basically, yeah, right in this direction. Where this beam is shooting up, right here. And we got to keep our eye on this. This is the same one that gave us all those X-class. And it's growing. That's the last report. It's growing. Wow, look at that. Look at that. See in this direction right here. So our amigos, our compadres, Comet 12P is having an effect, in my opinion. Everything I say is my... Pi oh, wow, look at this one. Wow, look at this. Tell me that's not a beam. I don't know if, if it just did a C-class, M-class flare, but that's that's basically where the neighborhood right here where comet 12p will be located and this has happened before there's nothing new catch it before and i'm capturing it again comet 12p will be right in this location so whatever our compadre is feeding off the sun is connected in my opinion everything's connected it's our energy that's what i see so we have this captured this is live this will be gone in a little bit yeah this area right here this is the one we had i think it was what or two weeks ago back and we got to keep our eye on the sun because the sun all the prophecies about the sun all the roads lead to the sun with the prophet all of them with all the recent activities with the vatican i got some so that's what we have right now let's check out this yep this area right here keep our, we need to keep an eye on it so clearly you can see right here and here this is courtesy sdo live data 3 30 in the morning now looking at space weather yes x2 so it was an x2 it released the x2 yep 
there it is right there just just happened another x class where that beam where that beam was di directed so now we're gonna have to keep our eye on all this all over again keep our eye on this so we got an x2 see right there right here you see that freeze it right oh man wait let's see if i could stop it hold on right there right there there it is right there let's take a look closely yep that's the x class i you meal yep let's make it a little smaller so we got an x class 2 i don't know if it's 2.9 or if it's a 2.9 it's, it's my book it's a 3 trying to see if i can find a beam nope right there look at that okay that's all i have for now i'll be back till next time Bedfather out